Mondragon and its festivities. Mondragon citizens are hard-working people who know how to have fun and maintain their traditions. Their festivities are the expression of their personality, resulting from living in community and from the wish to share. Popular participation, music, dances, gastronomy, multiple cultural expressions and all kind of events appropriate for all ages invade their streets during the celebrations. The major festivals are held in honour of St. John and have a special flavour because of the dates in which they take place and the atmosphere that can be breathed. They start with an eventful day in which different activities take place before a great multitude. It is worthy of mention Elementari Danza, the typical music and dance from Mondragon and which is deeply rooted. The music bands, the typical dancers and the crew walk the streets of the old town at the rhythm of this gorgeous and special melody, filling the villa with colour and warmth. In the main square, the mayor of the town dances before the St. John's bonfire. Furthermore, the poplar lifting, the hail in honour of the patron saint, the tamborrada, over 50 years celebrating it, the dragoi Hana, or popular dinner with hundreds of diners, and many other performances flood every corner of the villa during the festivities. Another very popular festival is St. Thomas Fair. It has been celebrated every 22nd of December for hundreds of years. The products of the farmhouse or caserio are the stars of contests of vegetables, fruits, cattle. Many people dress in farmers' typical costumes and take part in the variety of folk music offer, rural sports or handicraft and cattle exhibitions. A great popular lunch, sessions of berzolaris and an extraordinary atmosphere in the streets of the villa fulfill a day of ancestral tradition. More recent, though no less multitudinous, is the festivity of Marichu Cajoy. Since its inauguration in 1977, every first Friday of October, Los Chiquiteros are paid tribute. Their patron saint, the Virgin of the Rosary, popularly known as Marichu Cajoy, becomes the protagonist of the feast. The smart clothing is the most outstanding feature of the festivity, which attracts thousands of people. A special atmosphere can be felt in the villa and that is probably because it only lasts for one day. But feasts and traditions do not end up there in Mondragon. It is important to mention as well the festivities of its suburbs and streets where people gather to have a good time in groups at a table before a delicious meal or dancing. Especially charming is St. Agueda Eve. Choirs go around the suburbs, farms and streets of Mondragon singing traditional folk songs and collecting money and goods with social aims. St. Nicholas on the 6th of December is a charming day too. Most of all for the younger children who sing the song of St. Nicholas and receive in turn sweets, nuts, chestnuts and even coins, a bolo bolo from balconies and windows. Distributed throughout the year, these festivities and traditions speak aloud of people who know about combining hard work with a good and participative mood in the different acts which are a hallmark of their personality.